Post-intensive care syndrome. Every year, 80,000 people receive treatment at an intensive care unit. Thankfully, most of them recover well. Others, however, can find themselves facing a prolonged recovery with long-lasting problems. This is called post-intensive care syndrome, or PICS. Family members can get PICS family. Doreen is married and mother of three adolescents. She got the flu, followed by pneumonia and sepsis. Her situation was critical. She was 10 days on mechanical ventilation, received kidney dialysis and a lot of medication. When she woke up, everyone was very happy. But she had no clue what had happened. She felt extremely weak. Because she was delirious when she woke up, she was confused and frightened. After six weeks, she was discharged from the hospital. She could walk behind a walker. It was nice to come home, but it wasn't easy. She was very tired, forgetful, and she needed help with showering and housekeeping. Physical impairments common in PICS are muscle weakness, severe fatigue, pain and shortness of breath. Problems with memory, attention and concentration also occur. Multitasking and a busy environment can be difficult to handle. These are cognitive impairments. Psychological problems that can occur with PICS are anxiety, <gasps> depression, post-traumatic stress disorder or PTSD. Patients and loved ones can develop anxiety, depression and symptoms of PTSD. For relatives, these psychological problems are called PICS family. This also includes complicated grief in relatives of deceased ICU patients. These issues can cause problems in daily life, in the family, with work and hobbies. Doreen received home care. According to the rehabilitation plan, both a physiotherapist and a speech therapist visited her at home. The psychologist gave therapy for the flashbacks and the nightmares. Doreen read a lot about PICS and contacted fellow ICU patients. Slowly her condition improved. After a year, she was back at work, now part-time. PICS and PICSF are still relatively unknown. Some hospitals offer specialist aftercare for patients and family members after discharge from the ICU. ICU patients or family members who recognise PICS symptoms should consult their general practitioner or a specialist. They can arrange help for a physical therapist, occupational therapist, psychologist, dietitian, or home care nurse. Together, a plan can be made for what is needed to resume life after the ICU.